We in there with uh, Losers Finals, Bro Sidon versus Samedian. Scabs back on the mic with my man Vanilla Thunderbolt. This is an hey. interesting matchup. We're going to have to see. Submeeting fresh off that win against Cold Weather was playing with a lot of confidence. We'll have to see what Bro Sidon's able to muster on this. Now, we're going to have to see, actually, Yoshi has the ability to go ahead and apply just about as much shield pressure. Both of these characters want to be down airing their, each opponent's shields. Yoshi might be able to get out of it, though, with that second jump. So we're going to have to see how some median reacts to that if Rosan is going to be able to get rid of that key part of Peach's pressure. So far, just a couple neutral exchanges going just about even. Slight advantage to uh, Brosiden for now, but it's mostly just Yoshi being able to rack. The real test is going to be can this man kill? Yo the terminable problem with Yoshi is that Yoshi has no kill moves and very few good kill setups. And, uh, side note, I just realized this is the run back from, um... This is the run back from Winter Semis. Uh, it was game three, and Semedian lost two stocks very early to something, uh... I think one was, like, just a dunk. And he died kind of early. He couldn't pair us off quite back. Maybe it was a footstool? I can't quite remember. Something like silly like that. And then the other... Oh, God, he's got a bomb. Oh, God. Yeah, unfortunately, he's unable to make anything out of it. But so far, Brosidon seem, seems to have learned something from that last match. He's really been in the driver's seat this whole time. He's had the tempo of the game just firmly under his control. Oh, absolutely. That forward air not going to quite take it. Um, surprising, though, because it, it was... I guess he was across stage. And now we've got that, that unfortunate part where Sub it just does not want to challenge Bro Sidon at ledge. Yoshi's ledge stall game is pretty decent, and Peach is not really the best at getting out there. Ah! <laughs> and Bro Sidon, unfortunately, Bro Sidon's got that lead. He's going to go ahead and be content to play the projectile game. He's got the better projectiles. I don't think that'll kill for another 15% or so, 180. Yoshi's a heavy character. Ooh. <laughs> hit him with his own turn up. That almost leading to something nice here. Turn up dash attack, almost true combo. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be. What is Peach going to do to kill this guy? If Rasan just sits in shield and plays safely, what is the move? I mean, he's got to get. You, you figure, of course, Fair being Peach's best, but Yoshi's, Yoshi's got the spacing to beat that. Peach is one of those characters that does have t trouble killing. Fair is a great kill move, but it is not safe. Not good to throw out neutral. Dash attack taking it, but not before Brosidon hits 185. He's got a decent lead. We'll see how, how he decides to play. If he's going he's gonna to go ahead and play back with projectiles, or if he's, he seems content to play neutral right now. Oh, absolutely. Ooh, but Fair is going to get the aggression. Oh, very nice. Just calling out that... that that's, uh, so I mean, he wanted to drift back down on stage to start another mutual exchange. Both players sticking with their characters. I, I, I do think that this is a good choice. I mean, Samini does have a nice Mario, but the matchup's not much better. Yeah. Peach, du Peach du would seem to win this, or at the very least go even. Mario, slight advantage on Yoshi, but nothing too crazy. Well, then I think it's the familiarity of, like, you know, this is, like, this is our resident Peach, you know? True. I mean, we've s I've already seen him go Mario a couple matches this game, so he has no qualms switching for bad matchups, but it seems like he's got the confidence there in his main. And he has changed up a little bit much to his success here. Getting stuck in shield and turned the wrong way for that Nair. Couldn't get the reversal in. So I mean it's being a lot more slippery, a lot less likely to engage Brosidon in neutral. It's kind of just waiting for those hits when Brosidon goes in. Oh, dash it, dash grabs as Yoshi. Bad move. Do not do it. Hip check trading with the Nair, I believe. Ah, uh, kind of a weird counter. I don't know if that was yeah. intentional or not. Oh, trying for that forward air spike. Ooh, getting the Great call out. What is that, ground pound? Ground pound. Yoshi, star, I don't know. Yeah. I so we're, we got a the same thing that happened last time. Brosan taking the first stock at high percentage. And it's just a question of whether Samina can kill. Nice Nair there to go ahead and take it a little bit earlier than last time. It's 
couple stray hits and bread and butter combos. One thing that I've been really impressed with is that Poseidon hasn't gotten trapped above Peach. Peach is pretty good at covering grounded landings, and Yoshi does not have the best airspeed, though it is fairly good. Yoshi? Yoshi, yeah. Yoshi has great airspeed, what? Yeah, doesn't he have- he has the second fastest airspeed in the game. Really? Yeah, it's- it's Puff, then Yoshi. Or maybe I have it backwards, maybe it's Yoshi, then Puff. I, sw I swear to you, he's got, like, some of the best. In fact, I'm about a Kuragana hammer that shit right now. Nice float stall to basically bait out an over-aggressive option from Poseidon, coming back on with the forward air to immediately take full stage control. But that raw run-in and up-smash, and God the pause like. as well. Poseidon taking game two. Sending some medium to his the, the match of his tournament. He's got to go ahead and bring it back here. Both these matches have been relatively close. It's just Poseidon's finding kills as Yoshi relatively easily. He's really been exploiting some medium's drift. So Mita's really been, uh, he has not been in landing with aggressive options like Nair or Jab to cover himself. He's just been drifting back down to the stage and Brasan's cut it twice, once both matches. Still trying to prove me wrong, come on now. I, I have to, I have to. Airspeed, here we go. Hold on, Yoshi, fastest airspeed character. Really, well, my apologies, I was wrong. <laughs> Vanilla with the <laughs> playing the long con to make me look like an idiot. Every now and then, though, I, I, just, I, just got, I hear something, so I'm just like, wait a minute, it's not bad. It's actually the battle. <laughs> no, I think what it is, uh, I think he might not have a lot of acceleration. Um, so even though he has the highest top speed, he doesn't get there fast, I think is what it is. That could be it. Yeah, I just, he didn't feel, he never felt like that dominant to me with that. But yeah. hey, you live and you learn. That was a very suspect hip check. Oh, two miss space, but very close. Poseidon is thirsty for this kill. He's got a, he's playing with a lot of confidence right now. Dash attack will send him up. Another 20%. Ooh, there we go. Won't even need up. it. I'm gonna say another 20% dash attack will start killing. Doesn't even need it here. So now some medians at the percent. Oh, that was bad DI. Bad yeah, DI. Yeah, bad DI. Tell for the mix up. Exactly, yeah. Mm. Got to hold out for those Yoshi jab combos. None of them are true, but goddamn, are they not? Are they pretty damn good 50/50s. And they look cool as shit too. Oh yeah. Just scoop him with the foot, flip on him. Oh, he missed the B reversal on that neutral B. Good dare to call out the roll again. All these players have really been pretty damn good calling out any of those unsafe options from Edge. It's been standard get up or aerial get up, or it's been punished. Yoshi having trouble landing, but not digging that uh, that option by sub from the hip check. Hip check's really an all or nothing option. Yeah, actually. And when you're, oh, did he catch the jump? Yep. He did. All right, but he won't go out to punish. He said he's just content to go ahead and take another fair. Dash Ooh. attacking a jab. Both these characters are just. Hit away, basically. Exactly, yeah. Grosadin definitely has the, uh, there's definitely a kill for range from multiple Peach moves, but that'll actually help quite a bit. Ooh. Couldn't get quite as much on the, uh, egg as you might like, but... A little bit of an unsafe option there in the, in the down smash, going, betting it all on black. He probably Coming was expecting, back. like, a roll or something. Yeah, certainly. Ooh, Ooh here we go. very good tech. Oh, into no the... He way. dropped shield. I, I think he was afraid that he was going to get shield broken. Certainly, that's a good fear to have. You, but you got to roll out of that if you're scared of that. Yeah, absolutely. We're going to see uh, Bro Sidon take that 3-0 over Samedian and get the run back with DJ Shoryu for Grand Finals. Ryu versus Yoshi. That's going to be an interesting matchup now. Keep in mind, too, DJ won that 3-1 last time. So we very well, uh, you know, if he keeps it up, DJ Shoryu could really uh, really surprise us all by just taking this whole thing. Well, we're going to get right into it. Has DJ Shoryu been to JTS before? He was at the Slummit, but not uh, not anything before that. 